Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, I am African Bella, the real talk. But if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for returning back to my channel and thank you for the support. Please make sure you subscribe if you have not subscribed to this channel. You're going to learn a lot of things because I talk of life experiences, I talk of fashion, I talk of beauty, I talk of different, different interesting things. So please subscribe so that you cannot miss whenever I upload a new video. For today's video, I'll be showing you how I cook fish foil, the yummy one. <laughs> Guys, I really enjoy cooking. So I said, why not show you how I prepare this yummy fish foil? So stay with me till the end. Watch how I will prepare it and please enjoy. So this is the fish, I will remove them from the package I got from the market, they are two, this type of fish is called sea bass and what I'm going to do, I'm going to be removing the skulls of the fish because I want the fish to be clean and soft before I start marinating the fish. So I'll remove the skulls, the whole fish, both of them, and both sides. After removing the skulls, I washed the fish so they are clean, just like you see, very clean, very soft. Skulls are gone. And I have the spices here, which I'll be using to marinate. This is the fish spice. Then I have the black pepper. I have ginger, fresh ginger, I have the rosemary, fresh, I have garlic, this is paprika, I have the red pepper, This is lemon, olive oil, and salt. So these are the spices that I'll be using to marinate the fish. I'm going to grind the ginger and I'll grind it the old way <laughs> but you can blend it if you have a small blender you can blend it you can create it to make sure that it is soft just as you can see here very grinded and soft then I'll put it in a container 
where all the spices will be. So I'm going to grind the garlic also just like the ginger. I'll add some few salt in the garlic so that it can grind very well. After grinding this, the garlic, I'll mix it with the ginger and I'll mix all the spices together except the rosemary and the fish spice. I'll add them later. For now, I'll just mix all these spices, mix them very well. As you can see, they are well mixed. After mixing the spice, I will cut the fish, but not all, just pass the knife both sides of the fish so that when you apply the marination, it enters deep into the skin of the fish. So I will apply the marination. Apply, apply both sides, inside, make sure the whole fish is marinated and as you can see after that I will put the fish spice on top and down both sides I will apply this fish spice. This is the look of my marinated fish. I am going to be putting the rosemary up. After that, I'll have to close so that I can store this marinated fish in the fridge. And I'll store it for six hours. And another thing I forgot to say if you want to prepare this kind of fish, you need time so that you can cook something which will be so yummy. So you can store the fish, the marinated fish in the fridge for 
3 hours, 6 hours, it depends. So for me, it will be only 6 hours. I will cover very well so that the smell does not go out. <laughs> Yeah, here it is. So, after six hours, I am going to start to prepare the other ingredients that are needed for the fish foil. We have the onion and here is the fresh pepper and carrot. I will cut them all and mix them together. So here is the mixture of the veggies. I will take the fish and put it on the foil paper. Then I will take the veggies and put them on the fish and even inside the fish. Also I will put some olive oil into the fish. Put some oil, not so much, but some. I think it's enough. Then I will close the fish very well, ready to go into the oven. eat this fish with potatoes here they are 
ready to go into oven also so guys the fish is ready I want to show you how it looks you see hot <laughs> very good looking and juicy I want to show you very close you see it's very tasty guys even the potatoes are ready I'll also be eating it with salads and juice you're welcome guys <laughs> I want to show you I wish you could be here with me so that we can eat it together but anyway I'll eat it on your behalf thank you so much for watching guys please like give it a thumbs up if you have liked this video don't forget to comment what you think about this video also subscribe and watch other videos too until my next video ciao ciao Mwah,